Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you the get to know my dog tag. Even though I don't think it is one but I'm making it one because it should be. Everybody should put their dog on YouTube. Just saying. Today you have to meet Kelsey. Kelsey come here. Come here. She just got a haircut by yours truly today. Didn't you? Say hello up here. She's so cute. She looks like a little puppy again. She's adorable. But she's actually my sister's dog, so she's not actually my dog, if I'm being honest. As much as I'd love for her to be my dog. And she's so cute. Aren't you fuzzy? Because are you cute? Yes. <laughs> I thought I'd just put up this video today because I think it'd just be such a cute little thing to look back on when she's like older or not around which I don't even want to think about because it's actually so sad but like dogs just become such a part of your life you know and like they're so cute like they're always there for you no matter what like you could be having the worst day in the world but then when you go home you know as soon as you open that door like they're gonna be there like with their little wagon tail and like they don't care what you went through they don't care if you're stressed they don't care if you're rich they don't care if you're poor they don't care if you have a job they don't care what car you have like literally all they care about is how you treat them which is just amazing and I feel like people need to be more like that because the human race is just getting to be a bit cray cray these days so we need more niceness in the world she's a little hunger though like she could eat the whole family under the table and still want more food like she's crazy I don't know how she eats this that much my hair is looking very yellow or something today. I don't know what it is. I need to put in more purple shampoo to get rid of those tones. But yeah, I still like it. I think from some angles I look like Sia and it looks like I'm wearing a wig. I don't know how I feel about that. If you have a dog, please let me know. Either comment down below and like comment I know I was going to say comment your Instagram but then you probably don't want everybody finding your Instagram. Maybe I have all my links linked down in the description box down below. So find me on Instagram or Twitter or really anywhere really and uh, send me a picture of your dog because I'd love to see it. It'd be so cute. Or else if you have an Instagram for your dog uh, send it to me in a direct message or something because oh my god I really actually should make a Instagram account for Kelsey shouldn't I I don't know how to do that I feel like I tried to do that before but I couldn't figure out how to do it oh my god maybe I should try again especially now that she just got a haircut she'd be looking fine <laughs> so why don't I tell you some facts about Kelsey her full name Kelsey oh shit I can't remember her middle name is it Maverick Maverick I'll have to check. Yeah, her middle name isn't Maverick, it's Markville. So anyway, a full name. <laughs> Kelsey Markville Riley. Her given name was Markville. Or her given, did I say that right? Her given name was Markville. Like on her actual birth And then obviously, oh my god, funny story I didn't actually say. Right, my sister bought her as a boy. Like we went, she went to get a boy dog because they're cheaper they're, they're like the boys were like 250 and the girl yorkies yorkshire terriers were 350 so there was two little boys left with the mom and there was like a little chubby one and then kelsey she was like a little bit on the skinnier side and me my mom and dad were all leaning towards the little chubby brother we were like maybe get him he's like a little bit fluffier a little bit chubbier he obviously likes eating but natalie I think Kelsey's at my door. Let me go get her. Anyway, yeah. Me, my mum and dad were leaning towards the chubby brother. Because we were like, oh, he's obviously eating. He looks maybe he's like a bit healthier or something. And Natalie found a connection with Kelsey. Yeah, you. <laughs> so, Natalie ended up picking Kelsey. We brought her home. She got sick over my side of the car so I had to sit frontwards 
basically all our space, the whole driveway home. I should have knew then she'd be a little ship anyway. <laughs> I love her anyway. She's lucky. She's cute. But um, yeah, we get home and she's like, well, he is like out the back and he's peeing. But he's not like putting a leg up or anything the way that like male dogs do. He's like squatting and like peeing like a little girl. And we were like, why is he peeing like that? And then my friend and people were kind of like, oh, like, I think puppies maybe just pee like that. Like, maybe he'll grow out of it. And we were like, okay, fair enough. But um, then Natalie had to bring her to the vet to get, like, her boosters or second set of boosters or whatever. And the vet was like, uh, I have something to tell you. And Natalie was like, oh, my God, what, what are you going to tell me? And the vet was like, um, you have a girl dog. And Natalie was like, no, I don't. Oh yeah, by the way, Natalie, we called her Chester. So Kelsey's f first name for two weeks was Chester. And then after the two weeks, we brought her for the boosters, as I said, the booster shots. And the, do the doctor was like, you don't have a boy dog, you have a girl dog. And Natalie was like, what? So she had to call the owner that she bought him from, or the farmer, whoever he was bought the owner and she was she was like um you need to get this change on the birth cert because chester's not a boy chester's a girl <laughs> so natalie had to change the name obviously from chester because that's a boy name and she was like okay now i have a girl dog all of a sudden so she, she wrote down loads of names that were girl names that's kind of sounded like chester and it was between kelsey and something else i can't remember but kelsey is just such a nice name and I think like the first time I heard it was like, do you know the Metro Station album that had a song called Kelsey? So I think that was probably back around, probably when we were, maybe that was one of the reasons why we named her Kelsey. I, can't, I honestly can't remember. But I think that was the first time I heard called, like heard the name Kelsey. And I just thought it was like unusual and funky and unique. So I was like, yeah, like Kelsey's a lovely name. So we started calling her Kelsey. And I think that's the end of that story. But like it's mad. Like so she basically got a girl dog. For like a hundred euro. Cheaper. Because like when she rang the. Owner back up that she bought him off. He couldn't be like oh wait you owe me an extra hundred euro. Like he just let her off with it. So oh my god so funny. So for the first two weeks. Of her life. Well actually longer because we only had her for two weeks as a boy. So. I think she was already. Like. I don't know how old she was actually when we got her. Maybe a few weeks, maybe like two weeks. So maybe for like the first month-ish of her life, she was literally a boy and they were probably calling her, what was it, Markville? Yeah, probably calling her Markville. Oh my God, that's so funny. So she went from Markville for like the guts of a month. No, for like two weeks-ish. Then she went to Chester for two weeks with us. And then we found out she was a girl and she's been Kelsey for the last eight, nearly nine years now. Because she's nine next Saturday. That is actually so funny. I never get over that. But anyway, more with the fun facts. Yeah, she is eight years old. She, I'm convinced that she is a human trapped inside a Yorkshire Terrier's body. Because she is too smart to be a dog. It's creepy. Well, let me just switch my arm. My arm's getting tired. I'm not used to this vlog life. The tricks she, she can do is sit, lie down, give the paw and high five. Well, paw and high five kind of go, are kind of the same thing. But like paw, I just put my hand like more down and then high five is like, ha, ha. obviously everybody knows I do a high five. But yeah, I think I took a video of that clip of her doing her trick. So I'll insert it now. Look at Kate, see where you do tricks? Paw, good girl. Lie down, good girl. Sit. Sit. High five. Good girl. Lie down. There you go. You can go back to sleep now. Sorry for annoying you. You're so cute. <laughs> so cute. Kelsey has loads of nicknames. And it's really funny because she answers to all of them. Let me start. Kelsey, obviously, is her name. So we call her Kelsey. Kess. Kessie. Kessie Bean, Kessie Cakes, Bibi, Bibi Cakes, Fuzzy, Fuzzy Wuzzy, 
Kessie Cakes, Poopy, and sometimes I call her Bing Bing. <laughs> and she literally answers to all of them. Like, it's crazy. Like, Bing Bing, Fuzzy, Fuzzy. I think she's tired after her haircut. Either that or she's just taking the piss because she knows I'm filming. Don't you? You're making me to be a liar. Wait, I'll, I'll zoom up on her face. <laughs> sorry, Cass. She literally hates me right now, don't you? I'm so sorry, but you're just so cute. You're just so cute. Aren't you? You're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> Look at you, fan now. You have the life, don't you? Life of Riley. Living the life of Riley. She literally gives that saying a whole new meaning. Like, her second name is obviously Riley. So I love that saying, like, we're living the life of Riley. Because we actually are. And it's a saying that people say. Like, maybe it's Irish, I don't know. But it's a, it's a saying that people say in Ireland for, like, living the good life. I think it's from a song or something. But, um, yeah, I love it. Like the life of Riley. Literally when I have my own house one day, I'm going to have a plaque outside that has like my number or whatever. And then it's going to say the life of Riley. <laughs> so I think I'm going to leave you there. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe down to my channel if you haven't already. Hit that little bell notification if you want to get notified for when I upload videos. And I think that's it. If you have a dog, let me know and I will see you soon. Bye.